know you all saw the title of this video, and I know you're super excited about me opening up the A20s. But first, I have to say, a gun oil! Chewbacca. Chewbacca's sitting on her little the piece of foam there, and I just, I can't take it away now. I just want to take the shit off the floor, but she's like, this is where I live now. I live here on this piece of foam, so I have to leave the piece of foam. Anyway, I was told to buy this H2O gun oil, as it is a fucking hyper-advanced water-based lubricant. Not silicone-based. So there's a link to the gun oil in the description. But that's not what you're here for. You're here because some crazy person decided to send me 820s. And I'm like, alright bro, just, just hook me up. And I will make them sing. And I just loaned the Neumanns to someone so I can't compare directly. Which is probably for the best. Because... Ain't no reason why these are better than the Neumanns. Just ain't. Just ain't no reason. Ain't no sunshine. Maybe more comfort, maybe? Even though I'm not really a fan of how... Like, there's a point where things are just too big? Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. Why is it every fucking time I get a fucking... I should have known. Should have known by the size of the box. Oh, God. I think if I open the other side, nope, they're, they're right here. Oh, they're right here. Sorry, I'm having a moment. An angry moment, but it's still a fucking moment. All right, let me show you how to do this. I've, I've done this before. I'm, I'm, this is, Zeos is a smart boy. I know how make, how makes safety science go. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna tape up the corners. We're gonna make this box very deep. Then I'm going to reach in there, pull out its fucking lungs, and I'll, have to, I'll cut this tape and then it'll be a regular box again. I'm not going to let my rage take over. I, I experience Lux and Hyper Rage when I see p packing peanuts, and it makes me want to kill people, like literally, like, like Manson family. Murder balls. So let's do that. Then we need like a like a like a table. I guess like that table would work. I guess the floor will work also. We're going down. I'm going down. I'll pull out these these nice plastic. Get off of there. These nice plastic ones are nice. I should have enough height to lift this up without the peanuts falling. Oh, Jesus, no. Oh, Jesus, it opened. It's not closed. Oh, it's going to be filled with peanuts now. Oh. This is not the unboxing experience I wanted. Oh, God. Okay. There's three peanuts. I can live with three peanuts. Wow. That was terrifying. Anything else in here? Nope, and that's how you deal with peanuts in the Z, in the Z-verse. Um, the only cable he did not include with this is the 4.4 Pentagon, and I'm like, that's fine. Well, I'm just gonna use balance down of this anyway. And um, so we've got the standard. It's pretty sure it's not knotted, and it's just stuck. Yeah, no, it's just stuck. It's just stuck because it's a thick, fucking, stupid cable. I hate it. I have never had love for these cables, nor will I ever have love for these cables. They just are janked. $2,400 of a headphone. Go get me some tin T3 wires, you fucks. Arrgh, anger. It's fine. I don't have anger issues. It's fine. I use these connectors. What was the other headphone that used these connectors? That I, was com I like complained, but at least I was like, look, at least you could find them. And then this one's never been unwrapped. Of course, it's a single-ended quarter inch. So I'm sure that that's just jank heaven. Let's pull these bitches out. Pretty sure I put my fingers in the glass. Oh, yep, there's the glass, and I've definitely put my fingers on. Let's touch it some more. There is a concave. So I put water in that. It'll just—it's like a little bowl, glass window, that makes this a closed back. So it's an HG800 closed back. And I think these are the stock pads. I don't think they come with extra pads. It's a little bit of a folding issue from 
being in there. Wow, there's two screws located under there. I don't know if these pads detach. I guess they do. You can see there's just almost nothing in there. Give me, give me, the, give me the light. Oh, wait. Okay, so. Interesting. Here's our view. We've got a little piece of, like, Velcro there. I guess that's to hold that in place. You get some vents. There's our driver. There's a cover in front of our door. Very, very thin silk screen. Very thin silk screen around there. All redirecting the clothes. Oh, this is usually open vents on the 800s. Wow, this one's really got fingerprints, and I didn't touch it, so... I'm going to have to get out my special cleaning method to clean that. That's very cute. It's cool. All these need now is LEDs inside of it to illuminate that with a purple. And then we'd be really set. So let me reassemble this. That go there. Um, are these stock? Or are these like Dakoni? Dakoni makes HG800 pads. Actually, I should contact them because I had all their 700s. But I didn't have 700s to test on, so I ended up selling them in the yard sale. But now that I have A20s here, and I think the guy said that he can give me like a month or two with them, I may have the Coney send me over all their pads. Because it should just clip and clip, clip in place. There's a hard plastic member in here. You can see it's that bit. And then we clip on the member. And now, so I don't look like every other asshole on the internet. Which way does it, I love people when they put them on backwards. They put them on this way. What a weird headband. Made in Germany. Oh, that is kind of nice. I kind of, I've kind of turned on by that. Look, I love Sennheiser. I have 660s, 600s, 6XXs, 5.8Xs. Just, ah, uh, they're all ah. Uh. But they're 800s I never liked. Th these are actually, they feel too big. This whole pad thing is like, it touches parts of my face I don't want it to touch. It's not like, oh, just keep making it bigger so it doesn't touch your, your ears. Because now it's touching my jaw and like right behind my eyes. It's I'm a hard to please man. They never fit. They never just feel comfortable. They do feel comfortable though. Like as far as I don't think about it too hard. These are magnets. Yep. It's a wooden box. It's a wooden case. I'm going to put this cable back in it because... Fuck that noise. I store this box in that box. I'll put that box next door. I'll take this in the cable and we'll give the 820s their proper review. This plastic actually feels very cheap. This here, I don't remember it feeling cheap on the 800s. But it just feels like you could hear it. it. I feel like if I hit it hard enough, it's going to scratch it. I may have scratched it just now during that. Left and right. I do that for weight. I also don't remember the system of rotation. Did they? I have to really go back and watch my own review because I don't deal with it. I don't own 800s and I never wanted to. That's sort of weird that that bangs and makes that noise. Whereas the um, Ship 9500s literally have a piece of plastic or rubber stops. I didn't ask you a question, you dumb bitch! My Alexa's being... <clears throat> okay. Okay. Just, okay. Moving on. Uh, new unboxings every night at 1 a.m. Eastern. Um, why not? So you could all wake up and see if there's an unboxing. We'll see. We'll see how this works.